So, Cam, uh, can you just tell us a bit about your idea of the flipped classroom? Okay, my idea of the flipped classroom is to have, have the students access content, uh, information that would normally be delivered by the teacher in classroom and have it accessed online, either through video format uh, or documents or interactive text that they can uh, look, read and uh, write questions uh, to it um, outside the classroom, uh, either in a computer lab or at home, and then come into the classroom with their questions and then we can uh, collaborate, discuss, um, answer even just simple uh, homework questions that they would normally do. So uh, have you totally flipped the classroom or because uh, we know that uh, EMAD's uh, classroom is completely different to the traditional flipped classroom. What's your, uh, how are you different to, to how EMAD's doing it or how Duke yeah, is doing it? it it's evolved uh, over the year. It was initially just uh, PowerPoints with voiceover. Um, now the videos are PowerPoints with animations and other videos and skits and uh, what we then do is uh, we realise that some of the content was uh, too difficult or was very layered so we then made sure that uh, big big topics uh, we, we delivered some some instruction in class um, but we want to focus more on the specific uh, uh, work in class questions and, and uh, other content so that it's more blended it's, it's both you know content online but then also we deliver it in class as well so uh, can you tell me a little bit about how the kids have reacted to this? Has it, has it changed them dynamically in the classroom or is it just a, an extra resource that they're embracing or what's happening with that? Certainly an extra resource. It certainly divided the class as to whether they uh, like it or not. Some love it. Um, they can go and do their own thing, rewind the videos, answer questions, uh, revise. Others just you know, can't, can't gather the concept of watching a video and, and thinking that the, they'll learn from it. And I think part of it is their perception, um, that they're a bit resistant to change their uh, learning. Uh, but hopefully uh, over time that uh, students will see that it's a great, great way of improving their learning.